today I'm going to review a very simple app called Write Invisible. Now what it does is that you can keep on writing whatever you want to write over here, but it will not show you what you are writing. Now what purpose it is solving? The problem which is solving is that we prefer perfection. But in order to achieve those perfection, we pay too much time in trying to rectify our first draft. See, your first draft has to be something which whatever comes in your brain, whatever creativity comes in your, in your mind, just keep on writing that. Don't pay attention to the grammar, don't pay attention to how, whether it will work or not, just keep writing. Now can we do it if we can see, if you are seeing what we are writing? No. See there are tools available in the market like Grammarly, like Lingwix that can, that can rectify your grammatical mistakes. But what about the flow state? We write or we do things better when we are in a flow state and in order to achieve that flow state we have to stop judging whether my uh, text is grammatically correct or not and this is a problem which this app is solving so it is helping you to quickly uh, draft your first text so and it is also encouraging you to write every day because if we can keep on writing and writing and don't be distracted by our own mental barriers that whether I'm writing it correct or not, that is what it is solving. So you can create a demo account over here. They are going to give you a 30 days free demo account. Let me log into my account and show you how it works. The app is very simple as I've already shown you. Just you have to keep on writing. So if you do not want to make an account, you can use their trial one or if you write an account, if you create an account, in that case, you can download whatever text you've written. So I've written something over here. I'm writing something. If you create an account, then you can also give title to it. You can see when you have written what and there's a sort of gamification also attached. So right, let me give a title demo one and let me submit. I don't know what I've written. You don't know what I've written, but I have written something over here. Now, if I want to review, I can go over here. There are three options available, but let me write one more thing. Just you can click over here to write one more. So let me create another draft. Now, these are random text which I'm writing just for trial purpose. Over here, you can only write text. You cannot add images because the purpose of this app is that you need to create your first draft text quickly. So let me write demo two and make submit. So I have written two points over here, two articles. Now let me see whatever I have written. So you can click draft and you can find out what text you have written. Now before making this video, I have written two more texts. That was demo one, demo two. These are the texts which I have written before make, uh, recording this demo. And this is the text which I have written right now. So as you can see, here you uh, the date when you have written, it is mentioned. And if you uh, click view details, you can see whatever text you have written. You can download that particular draft and it will be downloaded in the doc format where you can click and then edit your draft. So the purpose of this article is not to write text, not to, it's not a text editor. It's basically the ability to write your first draft quickly. So that is the quickness of your first draft, not judging whether it is grammatically correct or not is something which it is, is solving. In the daily portion, you can see in a sort of calendar way what you have written, when you have written. Over here, you have to do it daily, something which they are encouraging, write every day. So they want you to develop the habit of writing every day. So this is more or less what this app does. They also have a sort of gamification where they give you point for writing articles or writing your drafts. So since I have written four drafts today, so I have got four dailies. So this is sort of gamification to encourage you. Maybe in future they will do some other things, but right now this is what you are getting. So as you can see, uh, these other things, they have a change log. You can find the change log down below. You have the link. The change logs are there. So this is the change log which they have done. The last update was done on 21st November. They have added the payment integration. So if you check the pricing, then you will find that they have a 30 days free trial right now. And they are also having a lifetime deal, which is available in Epsomo for a launch price of $7. 
so for a launch price of seven dollars you can have this for a lifetime if you see the plans you have unlimited draft you have updates and supports and other things over here and they are also giving you 1 gb of storage data but since you will be writing mostly text so 1 gb is i mean that's that's more than enough what i like about this particular founder is that he has uh, explained everything very clearly or with all the questions answers probable question answers if you have any other question answer you can obviously write mail to them or write over here they also have a road map so if you check the road map in the road map there are uh, three things which i liked number one is that uh, the ability of privacy where the uh, writers will have the option to bypass storing the text online so they can have it offline and encrypting everything which you're writing and also adding timer in the forms and word count right now these word count and timers are not available so this is something which they have in the roadmap so whether it is worth fifty dollars i don't think so with the present features it is not uh, definitely worth fifty dollars but it is definitely worth seven dollars because it will help you write your first draft quickly all the links will be in the descriptions and also in the pinned comment i did like the app and i will be getting a code for it whether you want it or not it's up to you but i like the idea i like the idea of creating the first draft without seeing what i'm writing and not wasting my time too much on the grammatical mistakes so let's see